guys, welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to be showing you guys some new customs that I have up for sale. So I have five new customs up for sale. Four of them are simple repaints and one of them is a full custom. So without further ado, we're gonna get started. So the first one that we have is this horse, which I did show in, I don't remember which video, but I did show it, I think it was in my other, my most recent more customs up for sale, but I hadn't finished this one. So this one is finished. It is a simple repaint. Um, I repainted the eyes, but I also painted the mane and the tail. Just a darker blue, just so it wasn't super plain. Here is a close-up of the eyes. I actually really like these eyes, mainly because they're like really big, you know, and so it was a really easy surface to paint on. There is just a few little pieces of hair in there. I don't know if you can tell, just a few little dust particles you could probably just wipe out with a slightly damp. Uh, paper towel. Yeah, I really love the eyes. I think they're super pretty. Also, these eyelashes are super pretty as well. Uh, the mane and tail are slightly dirty. I don't know why. You know, there's a few pieces of hair. There's also a little scuff there. And where is it? Oh yeah, right there. It's a little chip mark. I don't know where it came from but it's there. And on camera, the this blue is a lot lighter than it is in real life. In real life, it's a lot darker. And she also has a major tilt, as you can see down there. Or, you know, if you stand her up like this, you know, then her hoof is super high up, which I actually think is a cuter position, you know, just like, oh, the hoof is up. Also, she does have these weird, um, like, chip marks. I don't know where they came from or like what the person who originally had the cell piece was doing. Yeah, but she's have a little like, like they're trying to like cut off the tips of the ears and then there's just a little like right there. Like they're trying to shave off part of the foot or something. Next one that we have is this bunny which oh, I think her eyes are so pretty. The LPS itself is in pretty much perfect condition. She does have little dirt stains on the back, which you could easily clean up. But besides that, she's in pretty good condition, and I love her eyes. Can get closer? Oh yeah, a lot closer. I absolutely love her eyes. I think they're super pretty. I absolutely love the pink and the little silver inside. Super duper cute. The next LPS we have is this one, which I am in love. I like, I love her so much. She, I think she is super pretty. Once again, the LPS is in pretty much perfect condition. She does just have, you know, very minimal, whoa, whoa. Yeah, she has minimal scuffs back here, but you know, very minimal. All these customs, actually no, that's a lie, not all these customs, um, just this one. I tried a new eye style, which I quite like. Um, yeah, so we painted the eyes, and you can't really tell, but there are three different tones of colors. There's the original, there's a slightly lighter one, and then like a super light one in the corner. You can see at that angle, just a little bit. You can't really see the middle color too well. And then I absolutely love her eyelashes. This, I actually kind of made the eyelashes a mistake. I was originally just going to do, you know, these little eyelashes in the middle. And then I was just gonna do like three or four. And then I kinda like messed up, you know, and I got it like all over and I was like, hmm, that looks kinda cool. What if I just did it all over? So I did it all over and I really liked it. But originally it was chunky because I was just kinda messing around. And then I thought I really like that, so I wiped it all off and I redid it. Oops. Obviously much neater and a lot more eyelash like, and I think it's super, super pretty. And then I also did paint a little bit in between the mouth, little cracks of the mouth in the corners, just to give it more definition. And I think it has a very like anime look to it. I don't know, maybe, I think it might just because of the eyelashes, but it has a very anime look to it. That's just me though. This is the second to last LPS and the last simple repaint. We have this Kali. Um, it was a simple repaint of one of the LPS Lover QA bases. Yeah, I think she is so cute. 
um, I repainted the eyes, and I also added details in the cracks, so chest, I did white, and then on the pink, I did a darker pink, which I actually really like the pink part. I think it looks super cool, you know, like, realistic, and then we add over here and over there, and then just all over the face of this one. And then I did add on the purple, but you can't really notice on the purple. Here's a close-up. I absolutely love the eyes. I think they're super pretty. I tried a slightly new style. Um, yeah, so I have the original color, and then I have a lighter color in the corner to make it look like, I don't know, I guess you could say, like, a highlight gradient kind of thing. I don't know. But I think it looks super, super pretty. This is the last custom, which is a... Full custom, and oh my god, I love him, he's so cute! Oh my goodness, yeah, I absolutely love him. I think he is adorable, super duper cute. Uh, I re-sculpted the hair, I added some sculpted fluff in the ears. It looks really crappy on camera, but in real life it definitely looks a lot better. And then I added little extras on the cheek. And I re-sculpted the entire tail, which I am super proud of. This is my first, like, really- He's so small, he won't focus. This is my first, like, really detailed tail. And I love his eyes, they're super light on camera. But on this one, once again, I did, like, the- I have the regular green, and then I have a lighter green in the corner. I think it's so cute. Yeah, super cute. I absolutely love him and I just finished him today. And honestly, I'm in love. I also have actually found out a way to make customs without like the brush strokes because um, on a lot of my customs, like I've struggled with this for a really long time. Most of my customs, up until that one and a few others that I have yet to finish. Um, you could see, you could see the brush strokes in this one. Definitely. You know, on here. And like, on the face, you know, you could see where I brushed it. Like, with the paintbrush. You know, and I've really struggled with that for like a really long time, but I finally found a way to make the customs not have that. I just basically brush them. I have a paintbrush, you know, and I have the paint on it, and I just brush it in a circular motion all around the custom, you know? And so it's super, super smooth. So you can see against the light how smooth the surface is. You don't see any paint strokes, and it's super, super smooth, and I am so happy that I finally achieved that because I've been trying to make customs that don't- you can't see the brush strokes forever. Alright guys, that is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you'd like to purchase any of these customs, just go down like in the description to my eBay, and you can purchase one of them. I also have a whole bunch of other customs up for sale as well as a giant lot of LPS, just regular LPS, not customs, um, a huge lot, and then a few other smaller lots if you would like to purchase any just regular LPS. So that is it for this video. Once again, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to like, comment, and of course subscribe to my channel, and I will see you next week. Bye!